warned you. I laid it on the line to you time and time again. Right, well, this is it. I'm gonna give you a damn good trashing. Right. The first thing which I'm gonna do is to um, switch on my mobile phone because it takes uh, a minute or so for it to uh, kind of boot up as it were so we, we sort that one out uh, there's a drone uh, it's got a fully charged battery in there um, so we'll set that one up it's got an internal memory on it of 200 and or is it 100 and, 128 gigabytes I think internal drive that's quite good um, and there is a bit of a, a sequence here how you've got to set this up it's as I say it's very glitchy has become a bit of a nightmare to be honest no I think yep crashed again I'm gonna give you a damn good trashing the phone is still doing what it's gonna be doing booting up one thing or another and um, hopefully this uh, won't be too glitchy for me This is the problem. This is where you would have the DJI up and running by now. It would be up in the air flying. About 10 minutes later. Right, we get filming. I think we're filming. We'll send it off. And away she goes. Yeah, so as you could see, the uh, the footage from the drone is pretty unusable. But I just thought I'd get out there and, and fly my drone at a place called Highworth, which is about three or four miles from where I live. Just flying it from there, going slightly south and uh, to the west, just to the east of Swindon, uh, to see uh, how far I could fly, give it a range test and see whether the uh, return to home would actually work. So here's some footage here, sped up about 10 times, just flying it out. You can see the the quality of the of the footage is just it's unusable I'm, I'm so disappointed with this drone it doesn't do what I want it to do and when it does and you film it and you think you've got something but in actual fact that is just pretty unusable well, you can see here that it's clocking up it's over a thousand meters away come up to 1100 and I'm not getting much of a reading from the heads up display on the phone itself that's kind of lost connection so I'm flying by this here at the moment um, going to be moving it back turning it back towards me fairly soon um, yeah I've completely lost signal with the heads up display it's showing something which was a lot closer to myself obviously the drone is a lot further away heading up to 1300 meters away now and um, yeah so I'm not seeing anything on the uh, on the display on my phone of where exactly it is Houston we have a problem we, we, we shall return to home and we'll see what happens with that we'll see what happens it's not coming any closer no, it's coming back now because it's counting down 1700 we're just going to try the return to home and see how that gets on and it's counting down so we'll wait here with bated breath uh, to see if it actually comes back this is a Hubson Zeno Pro drone um, still no signal from the heads up here 
on my phone I can't it's lost connection on my phone but still connected with the the RC unit 1300 meters out and coming back in and we'll wait here until perhaps it comes back battery power we got We're on three cent off over there then send it off over yonder Let's see how far we can get it right so I'm just flying my drone outwards uh, from the home point going um, going north and west now uh, now the footage here it looks reasonably okay I've not done anything uh, with the app itself to alter the the format it's shooting in, it's still firing at um, 4K. So this is fairly, you know, looking at it, it's a bit grainy. Um, can't do much about that. Uh, there does seem to be some slight smearing uh, on the lens uh, to the right hand side. I'm not sure what's causing that. Um, but what's confusing to me is is that this seems to be quite almost acceptable in in a sense but the earlier shots I had where I set out earlier on this video they were just awful um, so I, I haven't done anything different and I don't know why this now the light and, and, and the colors seem to be a lot more clearer a lot more vibrant uh, it's almost DJI esque if you like uh, but the other stuff I, I shot earlier um, was just just awful, and I didn't even land it to uh, to restart the drone or anything. This is basically it's just one continual filming uh, shoot. Um, so I'm really confused about this drone. I really, really am. some low level flying just to see what the quality of the, uh, the actual film is like Let's see how much battery power we've got two we've got two they were take away and up Slight impact. Um, yeah, no damage done. No damage done. It's not filming. 
Right, I think we're filming. See the gimbal's working. Houston, we have a problem. Doing something, I'm not sure what that is. We'll take it back. return to home return cancel we we'll fly until it dies shall we Right, I think we're out of battery. I think the drone just completely gave up then. Completely out of battery, I think. Okay, so this basically concludes the video for this particular day. Um, I was kind of encouraged a little bit, let's say. Uh, I thought that the video quality uh, on the way when the drone was coming back to the home point seemed to have improved for some reason. I, I don't know why, but it just seemed to be uh, an improvement. Um, so that's a plus. Another plus is uh, people are commenting on my video giving me tips on how I can overcome these difficulties because they've been through them as well so thank you to those people who are doing that. Uh, three, I wouldn't mind trying to get hold of a, an iPhone just to see whether there is um, a compatibility issue between the Android and the iPhone that might be an issue as well and four, um, I'm shooting on 4K and my, com my PC can't handle it so if this video is a little bit glitchy or something I do apologize for that I normally use 1080p at uh, 60 frames per second uh, with my DJI drone uh, if I can somehow try and get the app to work uh, with the fly app uh, for the Hubson I will then change it over to 1080p at uh, 60 frames per second anyway just want to say thanks for watching uh, take care please like and subscribe if you found this was interesting please hit the uh, the notification bell to receive any more updates which I do in the future. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take care and bye for now.